Roland hit the ground running with his forecast today, and he's got the <laughs> S-word, snow, in this forecast. It's about time. Yeah. I mean, here we are in February, and it's been an awful lot like March and April yeah. as far as the temperatures are concerned. But now, finally, it started getting chilly yesterday. Did you guys feel it? The winds of change are blowing, guys, and I'm hoping that by the end of the day on Wednesday, Bogus Basin right here will have several inches of brand new snow. In fact, we might even have a little snow all the way down to the valley floor with some accumu accumulations possible on the grassy areas by Wednesday afternoon and after all of the clear skies that we've had, I think that's going to be an interesting sight. I think a lot of us have forgotten what's supposed to happen this time of the year, but that's good news because we desperately need to see additional snow up in the high country and, and continue to accumulate our snowpack. And don't forget, I've mentioned it many times before, March is just around the corner and March and April can be extremely active months for weather across the Rockies region. So 45 degrees right now, that's about average for this time of the year. 36 in Baker City, 30 degrees in McCall, 47 degrees in Ontario. It's 45 degrees in Caldwell and Stanley right now is 31 degrees. So what are the temperature trends doing? It looks like we're finally getting down to the average line for this time of the year and the average high is 44 degrees. So tomorrow, 46. On Wednesday, with the storm ahead of the front, we actually hit the average of 44 degrees, but then as the front moves through, temperatures are gonna to continue to cool through the day on Wednesday. 43 degrees on Thursday, just below the average. Friday and Saturday, we warm up again, but don't worry, that's because there's yet another storm that's on the horizon right around late Saturday and Sunday. So let's see what happens. This is fascinating to note on the future cast. Let's go through the day tomorrow, no surprises. Going to be a nice day. Lots of dry air, a little area of high pressure building in, and so that should guarantee lots of sunshine tomorrow. But then as the day progresses, we probably start seeing increasing clouds. And now let's go to Wednesday. Look at that front moving in from the northwest. This is the models indicating that this is likely going to be a widespread snowmaker for much of western Idaho. And then as we go through the afternoon hours on Wednesday, snow. Uh, across the central mountains, the west central mountains, and there it wants to generate a little rain snow mix for the valley floor. So I don't think this is going to be a gigantic snowstorm for us here in the Treasure Valley. But again, I think the grassy areas could pick up some accumulation. I'll know much more about how much we can expect out of the storm system by tomorrow. But there's the high pressure and here's the key. The high pressure that has kept us warm and it has kept us dry because it's been right along the west coast is expected to move away. So as the high pressure begins to move or retrograde off to the west, what it allows is the storm track to go up and over the top of the high pressure. And instead of affecting the areas here of the continental divide and points east, the storm track is going to dip down and it will allow one series of disturbances after another to move in. So this is a better pattern for storms. And again, I think it all begins on Wednesday. And then we have yet another storm that comes in late Saturday and Sunday. So enjoy the day tomorrow. Nice 46 degrees, partly cloudy skies. And then either rain snow mix or straight up snow on Wednesday, at least through half of the day on Wednesday here in the valley. And then on Thursday and Friday, we dry things out again. But another storm comes in here late Saturday and Sunday. Could be a rain snow mix or it could be straight up snow once again. We'll have a much better idea as that time uh, gets a little bit closer. And the mountains will have some snow certainly on Wednesday with more snow late Saturday and Sunday. So we're not done. And goodness gracious knows we need it. We do. Yes, we do. Yeah. But I'll have you watch that Saturday forecast as we get closer because I may be driving that day. Mm. Okay. okay, maybe on the highway, so we'll do that. Keep your fingers crossed it's not too bad. Okay. Coming up on KVOI 2 News, Valentine's Day 